Basketball season came to a close last night around Kern County, and our male athlete of the week made sure West High ended on a high note. Here's 23 ABC's Casey Kiernan. At just 5'7 and 16 years old, it would be easy to overlook Austin Contreras. People definitely um, underestimate him at times. But when the sophomore's dropping 33 points like he did against Tehachapi on Tuesday, he's impossible to miss. When I hit the first shot, I knew I was, I was feeling good. As a shooter, once you hit one or two of them and you see the ball goes in, I mean, the basket gets really big for you, and that's just what happened to him last night. Austin says he couldn't have done it without his teammates, and you can bet the upperclassmen won't let him forget it. And he's got a lot of talent, you know, shooting the ball, so we try to find a way for him to get in the offense and score points. What is it like being one of the younger guys? <laughs> it's like I'm um, the little brother, I guess. He is sort of the uh, little brother, both probably in stature wise and in youth on the team. Um, I've got some pretty boisterous guys, they like to have fun. Um, and he's sort of a guy who's pretty quiet, but when he gets around him, he comes out of his shell, he opens up. West has had success all year with Austin opening up the offense. And with another double digit performance last night against Golden Valley, the Vikings enter the playoffs standing tall. Right now, we're trying to head into the playoffs as you know, one of the top two seeds. We feel like if we can get one of those, we can make a real strong run in the playoffs with the team that we have. Sure, Austin scored 33 against the Hatchby, but we know it's a really a team effort. Yeah. Really. Okay, however, only one person can get the award. So, Austin, here's a plaque brought by Kern Trophies, man. You're our athlete of the Let's week. Go, yeah. Casey Kiernan, 23 ABC Sports. And there he and is. And they leave him by himself. <laughs> of course, good luck to the Vikings in the playoffs. Don't forget, tonight at 11, we'll have our female athlete of the week. All right.